The city's transit department will be adding some electric buses to its fleet later this year, and staff recently got the chance to test out the new energy-efficient rig. All right, you guys ready to go out on the road? We're going to be receiving four Proterra ZX-5 buses later this year, likely in the fall. So we'll be replacing four of our old diesel buses with brand new all-electric technology. This purchase is in part due to a $3 million DOT grant. The buses will be able to go over 300 miles on a single charge. This purchase aligns with the city's climate action plan. One goal is to shift 55% of vehicle trips to more sustainable modes of transportation, such as walking, biking, and using transit. This will help make sure that we have new technology for the community to help make transit more attractive for the community, but also help reduce greenhouse gas emissions at the same time. It also cuts down on noise pollution because the electric motor is significantly quieter. The four new buses won't arrive until at least fall, but the chance to get behind the wheel of one of these electric vehicles has staff eager for change. We're just really excited to test out this technology and move Iowa City Transit forward to the future. Curbside customers who aren't already using the city-issued organic carts are going to need to make the switch this summer. Beginning July 1st, customers will no longer be able to use personal 20 to 35 gallon containers. Along with the yellow lidded bins, paper yard waste bags and bundles will also be collected. The carts are lifted with a mechanical arm and significantly cut down on workplace injuries from having to lift heavy containers. If you don't have a city organic cart, don't worry. You can request a 25 or 95 gallon cart for free. Just head to icgov.org organics to fill out the online form. If you already have an organic cart but want a second one, you can do so for an additional $2 per month added to your utility bill. The warmer weather means pothole season is upon us. The wear and tear of the brutal winter is obvious, and the city streets crew is in full swing repairing potholes. You can help by reporting places that need to be patched up. The easiest way is to use the ICGov Express app. You can download the app to your iPhone or Android by searching Go Request or you can make a report at icgov.org slash icgovexpress. You can also make a request by calling our streets division line. This time of year, the demand for repairs is high, so please be patient as we work to get to all the roads that need attention. The city is in search of an artist to design, create, and install artwork as part of the Kiwanis Park Community Gardens. The artist will be responsible for working with neighborhood residents for input on design, location, and features. Submissions are being accepted through Friday, April 2nd. Artists would be expected to complete the installation by August of this year. Find the form and requirements at icgov.org slash public art. That's our show. Have a great week, everybody. We'll see you next time on Iowa City Update.